We have our PBX, so which one's the one of the rings above there. What, what brand's PBX? Is that Panasonic? Yeah, it's a Panasonic. So this would be, come in, just come in. This would be our server room. It's a, where a lot of the administration, ICT administration happens. And uh, this is Yusuf. So we get Moodle, Proxy, Koha, Content, and Mail. And, do you use uh, any network monitoring software? We use Webmin. Webmin. Across the, you might see some of our students carry these. These are Panasonic TAF books that are part of our UBridge project uh, with which we partner. So students get these donated to them. They pay a little fee, normally for the taxes and administration of getting them into the country. They take them in, stay with them for three years while they're here studying. They use those and. Uh, at the end of the three years, they have the option of buying it out and going with it or returning it. And then the next student will take it on. Are these new? No, they're refurbished. They're refurbished. Are yeah. you still able to import them? We had a real huge problem getting them in. Right. Same you issues also been affected the by the, the yeah. ban. And I, I, I keep saying, if that ban were put in effect, I don't know how many students here would not have this. And that is quite many. The other brand, is uh we had some of these uh mm -hmm. and then uh we had another branch uh this Selenium. yeah uh these are little dull things netbooks that our lecturers use right they are all stacked up here with charging and uh we come in we sign for them if they need to use a Dima in any of their classes, they'll sign for one as well. They'll go and then use it and bring it back. What do you use to, um, well, if you need to reinstall like Ubuntu, do you like use cleaning software or anything like that? Uh, no. You I mean, just install from yeah, scratch? Yeah, we install from scratch. And I guess because you've got the mirror, it yeah. takes no time at all? No. Our, our E-Class and e -learn all network boot. Right. So right. every morning at eight they'll be up. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And uh so cool. Have you been yeah, I see you've got Elpic on the board, have you been following mm -hmm. your training materials? Yeah. I was actually I helped to I went with Yusuf in Nairobi, I helped to draft the material right. for the guy. Cool. Yeah, cool. Very organized. So this is a good uh, sample of the lecturer. She's using one of the netbooks and she's uh, a lot of her stuff is projected. We mounted the demos from the ceiling. So they just come in, pick a thing and uh, they plug in the way. Like the one there in the front and everything will just, she'll just take on a class and so we have uh, our routers, well these routers are stuck across the entire floor. This is our power rack. Uh, it runs straight from down the hospital all the way through the rest of the When something is done, we have a standby generator that fires in about uh, five or six seconds. So it's on the outside when it's down. We do that. Uh, stuff print. She's the admin. She will, she will know what about the bridge until she's arrived.
I had spoken to the office, but at the time I was the one setting up the same thing there. Right. And I hadn't gotten here to organize the deal. Well, if you're doing the LPI stuff, that's really good stuff. Mm -hmm. Backup's good for mail servers too, because it's all text. You can get like six months of backups on a 300 gig hard drive for every hour of every single day. We did that downstairs at ISK. Photocopying and printing happens. We have someone will help run the lab, but also they'll help manage all the student printing. We're thinking of outsourcing the function so that we could actually replace whoever sits there with a more skilled, more technical person. And then we could uh, outsource the printing and copying function. That way we can have someone sit there but actually do more rather than just managing print, print This is us. We're, we're using the 